With Roth, the writer, the citizen, the American man from Newark, New Jersey, our conversation began at the end when we asked him to read the final passage of Every Man. Roth's hero, who's on the operating table awaiting cardiac surgery, is suffused with the memory of his boyhood invulnerability. Nothing could extinguish the vitality of that boy whose slender little torpedo of an unscathed body once rode the big Atlantic waves from a hundred yards out in the wild ocean all the way into shore. Oh, the abandon of it and the smell of the salt water and the scorching sun. Daylight, he thought, penetrating everywhere. Day after summer day of that daylight, blazing off a living sea, an optical treasure so vast and valuable that he could have been peering through the jeweler's loop engraved with his father's initials at the perfect priceless planet itself, at his home, the billion, the trillion, the quadrillion carat planet Earth. He went under feeling far from filled, anything but doomed, eager yet again to be fulfilled, but nonetheless, he never woke up. Cardiac arrest. He was no more, freed from being, entering into nowhere without even knowing it just as he'd feared from the start.